everybody to this anime game Otaku95. Last episode, we found out that Infinite has the ability to make clones, replicas like like the clones of Shadow, the clones of Chaos, Cyborg, and the clones of Metal Sonic. And well, I don't know what's gonna happen next, so let's go play. Listen up. We just got word that Eggman's forces are undermanned at his headquarters in Metropolis. They're probably staging somewhere else as part of Eggman's plan. This could be our only chance to take the city. Hmm, only chance, huh? Exactly. That's why we're focusing on a full frontal assault on Metropolis. I'm calling it Operation Big Wave. Big Wave? Those are the names of two characters. Big the cat and Wave the purple board. Who cares what it's called? What's important is to have a well thought out strategy. Yeah, so what's the strategy? I thought up this strategy in about a minute and a half. We're that quick. And fast. We're not gonna stop till Eggman's army is destroyed. Sonic is busy fighting Shadow, but the rest of us can do this. We've got the strength and the spirit to win. There's no finer group that I'd want to fight with. Ha! Great speech! Let's give Eggman an old-fashioned beatdown. Yeah, let's beat him up. They have more in sheer numbers. So the idea of a quick, focused attack isn't bad. We also have Sonic. I mean the other Sonic. So I have no doubt we can do this. Also, if we can destroy the Phantom Ruby, we should be able to send the other Sonic home. At least I hope so. This is all new territory for me. Okay, let's head straight for Eggman's HQ. Time to save the world, people! Yeah, let's do it! Uh oh, I've been spotted. Activate the Phantom Ruby. Make them wish they'd never been born. Stay calm. What you're seeing isn't real. It's no use. Our troops are scattering in the confusion. Ah! This is bad. Our forces are all gathered together, and now they're plunged into chaos. Lightning. Yep. It looks like the attack strategy didn't work, so I don't know what's gonna happen next. Whoa, that was close. I almost got hit by a laser. Eye. I got all five stars in this stage. In one try, nice. Yeah, let's get out of here. Uh-oh. Something tells me I'm gonna have a boss fight with Infinite. Okay, but first, let me see what great I got. Yay, I'm not supposed to- Yay! Yep, I knew it. I'm gonna have an odd boss fight with Infinite, and this time I'm gonna use my avatar for the stage. Let's go play.
Okay, give away the fight. Uh oh. Okay, at least I could hit him with the lightning. Ah, oh, no, I touched it. I was supposed to touch it. Oh man. What be killed for? Nah, man. Get the wings, get the wings. Uh oh. Come on, come on. Uh oh. Uh oh. He's angry. Uh oh. Uh oh. No, like oh, no! I was trying to move, but I went too soon. Come on, come on! Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Oh! Oh no! Ah! Why did I do that again? Why did I touch it? Come on, come on, come on! Says, whoa! Easy, easy now! Ah! No! The wings! I need the wings! I won. Now, time to get yourself beat up. Man, take that, and this, and that. Take that, and this, and that, and this. Aww. Oh, I got an A. It's because I keep dropping the wings. Because I, I keep on touching the red stuff. Which I was trying to avoid it. But, eh, at least I passed the stage. Well, Infinite got away and, well, at least my avatar survived some, his illusion attack. Maybe it's because she picked up the, the Phantom Poor type rock thingy she picked up audio in the last episode, so... What's going kind of next? Things were going well with Operation Big Wave. Then everything fizzled out when that Phantom Ruby kicked in. Yeah, you didn't take much of a time to make a battle strategy in less than a minute or something like that. That fake shadow was created using the Phantom Ruby's power, right? Even if it's a virtual reality projection, it's as strong as the real shadow. Rouge, have you found the intel I was looking for? No, not yet. But I have reports that Eggman's database is located at the chemical plant. Can we go plant? If we can check that out, we might find something there. Okay, let's go check it out then. That sounds like a promising lead. We have to figure out the secret behind Infinite's power and virtual reality. Tails, can you handle this? Got it. I'll take Sonic. I mean the other Sonic with me and head to the chemical plant. Oh, this is a little. Oh. There should be a database somewhere. We have to locate the building it's in. There's a lot of ground to cover, so just finding it will be a chore. Yep. This level looks familiar. It looks, it looks like the level from Sonic the Hedgehog 2. Whoa. Okay, I guess I'll go this way. Whoa. Whee! 
Whoa, getting dizzy. Whee! Uh oh, the water. I better get out of the water quickly because if I stay a little too long, Sonic might drown and I'll lose. And I'll probably get back to the checkpoint where I died from, but I'm not gonna take a risk. Yep. Whoa. Why is those spikes everywhere? Whee! Uh oh. Ah! Something must have triggered it. Stay sharp. Ah, get out of water, get out of water. Oh, okay, that was close. Whoa, don't fall. If I fall, I have to go back climbing up again. There you go. Ah! No! My protection shield! Oh well. Whoa, that was close. I almost fell in a waterway. And I won. Okay, let me see what great I got. Yay! I'm not super A! Yay! Terabytes? Is that bigger than gigabytes? And who will take that many selfies? Found it! Virtual reality weapon, the Phantom Ruby. A weapon that takes control of people's visual and depth perception to feed false information to the brain, creating a new reality for them. Like a dream so real, if you bump yourself in it, your sleeping self will bruise? It's hard to believe. Yep. Eggman experimented with lots of prototypes and then incorporated the final version into Infinite. I'm reading this data correctly, then there might be a weakness. So what's the weakness? This is huge. Let's get this information back to the others. Okay, I'm gonna go take a break and end this episode, so until next time to this anime game, Otaku Night 5. Bye!